What's going on 3D printers? It's Rob from Mad Jack 3D Prints and today I'm going to show you how to take an image you get in Google and turn it into a 3D model for printing. Let's go. Alright, what's going on guys? I'm going to get into a little bit of screen capture footage here. We're going to download an image off of Google convert that into a 3D model and get it ready for printing. It's real easy. All right guys, so we're just gonna try to convert a 2D image into a 3D model. So the best way to do that is to find a grayscale image. So let's use Google. Captain America's coming out this week. I'm excited to see Civil War, so Let's Google Captain America shield silhouette. So we have an image here. We're going to download this bad boy. It's selva3d.com. And it lets you upload your image right into an app on your web page and it converts it into a 3D model for you. So let's check this out here. I'm gonna click upload image. We're gonna pick this Captain America shield and it's gonna create a preview for us. So right off the bat, we have a 3D model. Okay, so there's two different models you can download here. One is free and the other you have to buy credits for. Now I have used one of the free credits that they give you when you sign up. And it actually is a higher quality model. But, you know, if, if you're just doing something for yourself and you're not, you know, you're not getting paid to do it, you don't have a client or anything, go ahead and just use the free one. The quality is a little bit better. It's more of a cleaner, high-res model. I mean, it's not light years beyond the free one. So I haven't played with this much to see what the actual cost is. But it is a little better. All right, so here's our 3D print in Cura. You notice it's two separate pieces. So this wasn't the best example for me to use, I suppose. Um, Again, I would be using my own 3D software, 3D Studio Max, or ZBrush, um, and that's easily fixed. I would just model a bottom piece down here to connect them. Uh, if you don't have 3D software, I would recommend using Tinkercad, which is another free web app that you could use, um, and you can easily connect these two pieces here but that would be another tutorial. But again, this is just showing you guys, you can take regular 2D image or even a photograph and easily convert that and make it into a 3D model for printing. All right guys, that's all I got for you today. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. I'll be back in the next couple weeks with another one for you. 3D printing is the future and the future is now. What's going on 3D printers? It's Rob from Mad Jack 3D Prints. Today I'm going to show you how to Google Eminem. Google Eminem.